Good day, guys. You might Aris Tao here. Welcome to the Godox Light Modifiers 101. Soft light is more pleasant than hard light in terms of portrait photography in general. And soft light needs a large light modifier because it's so lightweight. Unlike the most versatile light modifiers, you can easily carry anywhere with you. And the best part is, it takes no time to set up. First, let's compare the standard modifier, which is smaller light source, with umbrella, which is the larger light source. You can see that with the highlight are not so hot, the shadow are not so deep, the transition in between is softened and blurred. Tips 1. Change the light distance between the light and umbrella would affect how soft the light is. Tip 2. Watch the height of umbrella if you'd like to catch light in her eyes. Godox offers three kinds of umbrella, translucent, white, and silver. Would you be using the umbrella in a restricted indoor space? Reflective umbrella focuses the lights in one direction, and translucent umbrella diffuses the light in all directions. Are you using small strobe, such as hot shoe flash? Then translucent umbrella would be a good choice. First, shoot through umbrella saves light output comparing with reflective umbrella. Second, with shoot through, which is a translucent umbrella, you can place the umbrella super close to your subject. Comparing with translucent umbrella, which offers one layer of diffusion, you can choose to further soft your light by adding multiple diffusion layers in front of your reflective umbrella. Reflective umbrella offers reflective plus diffusion option. You can choose how soft your light is by adding multiple diffusion layers if you wish to. For outdoor photography, I would combine speed light with translucent umbrella because translucent umbrella would save a bit light output. For larger strobes such as 8300 or 8600 Pro, I would combine them with reflective umbrella. The reason is that I can afford to lose a bit more light output in exchange of further diffuse light. As translucent umbrella diffuse light in all directions, reflective umbrella limits light in one direction. I would use reflective umbrella to control the light spill, especially in restricted indoor space. Comparing with the ID interior, Silver interior reflective umbrella delivers slightly higher contrast and slightly higher light output, which is more suitable for crispy fashion look. And the white interior delivers soft light, which is more ideal for an all-rounder look or portrait look. I would use the white interior plus diffusion for aged group, commercial portrait, family portrait, and use the silver umbrella for high fashion model shoot or I simply prefer higher contrast light from time to time. Godox offers four sizes of umbrella, 85 cm, 105 cm, 130 cm, and 165 cm. It's a good idea to keep umbrella relevantly close to your subject to deliver soft light. From a meter away, if we pay attention to the highlight over the forehead and the shadow cast on the nose, all the umbrella delivers soft light with similar quality. Note that 85 and 105 cm only covers half body, and 130 and 165 cm covers full body. From 2 meters away, the 165 umbrella still delivers soft lights while covering the full body. On the other hand, the output of 85cm umbrella obviously harsher. Everyone has their own recipe about how soft the light should be, and their own combination regarding the umbrella size, distance from the subject and extra. I find 85 and 105 great for half body shoot. I find 130 and 165cm umbrella more handy when I shoot a full body portrait because the light is still soft when it's further away from the subject. In the next 30 seconds, I want to show you three ways of outdoor light setups with Godox 105 umbrella. Because the umbrella is capable of delivering very soft light, 
the light direction can be more forgivable. You can pretty much light your objects from any direction you like. One of the most conventional ways will be use it to mimic a window light source from side. Tips: Place the model at the edge of the umbrella rather than the central umbrella for a further softened light effect. You can place the umbrella over her head to mimic a cloudy overcast day. Tips: Place the model at the edge of the umbrella to avoid the deep overcast shadow. Notice the light on her face is quite pleasant, but not so much on her feet, simply because it's 105 umbrella. That's why I would advise people to use 130cm and 165cm umbrella for a full body shot. You can even also place the light below to fill in the shadow on her nose and chin. Bonus is that you can even have this awesome catch light in her eyes. Tips for natural look, reduce your stops comparing with lighting her from side or top. Godox offers one-stop solution for all your photography needs. From flash, LED lights, to light stands, and of course a wide range of modifiers. They've definitely